Good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning. The starting line for this race. Thank you guys so much for coming. Begins across from the theater where 12 lives were taken 10 years ago. And we just knew with the memorial and the 10 year um, anniversary, we really wanted to support everyone that was involved that day. Runners like Lisa Gamara, born and raised in Aurora. And I'm already kind of starting to think about the things that happened that day. Already know the next five kilometers will be an emotional but inspiring journey. It's amazing to see the community and everyone come together to do something like this today. This is the, the absolute most humbling moment of my entire life, and I really can't thank you guys enough. All right, let's get this thing started. It was Zach Goldich's idea to organize this 5K. On your mark, get set, go! It's called the hero's journey. Everyone's a hero in their own way, and this is to commemorate and celebrate those people. Zach is a survivor. Uh -huh. He was just 17 years old when he called 911 for the first time ever, after being shot in the neck during the Aurora Theater shooting. I wanted to get into the fire service because I always had a curiosity to see what that side would be like, you know, being on the other side of the 911 phone call. Now he's a first responder at South Metro Fire. And when times get tough, you know, there is light at the end of the tunnel. There is a finish line. But then once you reach that finish line, it doesn't just stop there, you know, it, it moves on. The finish line for this race ends at the 720 Memorial's Reflection Garden. Race organizers say it symbolizes a journey from tragedy to hope. So along the way, you know, you're going to meet encouragement, you're going to meet support, you're going to meet a hero who might encourage you, you know, to finish this race. Zach says this race is about everyday heroes. You know, like those people don't get, get through those tough times alone. And I think the people who are there for other people are, are, are the real heroes. Courtney Yoon, 9 News. The proceeds from today's 5K will go toward the Zach Goldich Opportunity Scholarship. That will benefit a local Aurora Public School student.